And number six, and this is a big one, and most people don't realize the connection between forgiveness and abundance. A lot of times when people have been doing all these steps and they're still struggling <clears throat> financially and otherwise, it has to do with the fact that they're still holding uh, a re regrets and resentments toward other people or toward themselves. <clears throat> and forgiveness means you are for giving. You're not forgetting, you're forgiving. When you are forgetting, you literally forget. You literally forget who you are. You literally forget your connection to this infinite supply. When you are for getting something, you forget. You're in a state of ignorance. But when you are for giving, when you're all about giving forth instead of trying to get, when you're, when you're giving forth instead of withholding, then you are in a state of forgiveness. And you activate more and more of the abundance and you release those blockages within your system that are holding and blocking the, the, the law of circulation from flowing through you. So forgiveness, being forgiving. Now there's a lot more to forgiveness, which this isn't a, a, a training on forgiveness. I'm sure you've had some trainings on forgiveness. But, but there's a lot to that. And that's a whole class in and of itself. But begin to, to consciously be willing to forgive. To release people. Forgive them their debts. Your debts are forgiven as you forgive them their debts. So it doesn't just mean forgive their debts like the money they owe you. It means forgive the debt that you think they owe you validation. They owe you approval. That person betrayed you. They owe you an apology. The world... See, you may need to sit down for this. The world doesn't owe you anything. Nobody owes you anything. Not appreciation, not approval, not validation, not respect. It's a tough one. That's a tough one. That's a big old hairy horse pill to swallow. But the world owes us nothing. Because again, the world can't give us anything we don't already have. You've got it all within you. Nobody can take anything away from you and nobody can add anything to you. So anywhere you're holding somebody in debt, where they did you wrong and they need to give you something to make it right, you're really holding yourself in debt. Holding resentment towards another person is like drinking poison and thinking it's going to make them sick. You're making yourself sick. And you're blocking the law of circulation to allow for more of this abundance to flow into your life. Forgiveness primarily is for yourself. It's releasing yourself. And as a benefit, you create a space where that other individual may have an opportunity to heal and to awaken themselves. And wouldn't that be wonderful, really? I know you may hate them right now or think they've done you wrong and they're bad and they're evil, but wouldn't it be great if they actually were healed and they were awakened and they couldn't harm anybody anymore? So forgiveness, so, so important. And a key to activating the law of abundance in your life. All right? <laughs>